At a party to open a new exhibition of masks, more than 500 celebrities painted masks for the special exhibition. Stephen Lee was there to see their handiwork. Rich and famous might not like to be unmasked, but when Prince Charles invited hundreds of celebrities and notable names from around the world to paint masks for his Prince's Trust charity to auction, the works came flooding back by post. Now with 500 pieces, including two painted by Prince Charles himself, on display at luxury goods store Liberties, it's a chance for everyone to see the original and unique works before they go under the hammer at Sotheby's where organisers are expecting the masks campaign will raise as much as £1 million for the Prince's Trust charity. In fact, the show's organiser, who imported the celebrity masks idea from Israel, says it was Prince Charles's own love of painting that convinced him to approach the Trust with the idea. The Prince is a painter himself, so I was sure that when I come to him with a project like this, he would want to support it. And his people were not so sure in the beginning, but I said I don't have a problem. You present it to the Prince, he'll come, come along. And when I met him, and when I said it to him, he was very pleased with that. That, that's what, that was one of the reasons we brought the project to him. Some of the masks are jokey, some little more than doodles, but others show hours of thought and careful crafting. All, however, say something about what the celebrities were thinking, and in fact, probably go a long way to unmasking their real feelings. How interesting it was to see all the people, how they work, how different each mask is, how revealing it is about the people, the surprises that you find, you know, discovering people that you know, doing things that you don't expect from them. I got a lot of um, sparkly glitter and sequins and got busy with the glue and the paint and I had a wonderful time. That spoon belonged to Prime Minister Rabin and um, I thought that it would be to give it away to a good cause. I've just done something which I thought was interesting, amusing, offbeat, colourful and I don't know whether I've achieved it or not but it was for a good cause so I had the courage to send it in. So if you want to come face to face with some of your favourite stars, head down to Liberty's.